Hello, many thanks for joining me for a, uh, not a, a, not a real ale review today, as you can probably guess from the title, it's a Somerset cider review, or real cider review, I don't know. Anyway, I got given some cider over Christmas, I don't normally drink it, but being from Somerset, I think it's about time I give review um, some cider. It's from the Thatcher's um, Brewery, I suppose? I suppose it's a brewery. This is their Green Goblin Oak Age Cider. Um, this, is, this brewery is really close to me, it's about five miles away. I um, have actually been there and uh, tasted a few of their ciders. I don't dislike cider, I do like it, I just don't tend to drink it because it gets me really um, drunk. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've had this before. It's 6% um, ABV in a green 500ml bottle, I believe. I believe it's, yep, 500ml. Yeah, fantastic. Right, let's crack it open now. A little bit of smoke on the opening. Black, plain black crown. Um, I haven't got a cider glass, so I've got a lager glass. A pilsner, well, a lager. -y. Wow, carbonated. Um, it's probably going to be a bit of a, more of a jokey review of this. I'm not going to rate it because. Um, I've really got nothing to rate it against, but I'm just going to see whether I like it or not. Why well, not I like it? I might have chuck a lot in there, I suppose, isn't I? Lovely job. Right then. Well, really carbonated. Sort of golden, getting onto amber in colour. Lovely. Looks really appetising. Loads of carbonation popping up on the head there. Let's get a nose in, shall I? Oh, you can, I'll tell you what, that's really weird, you don't get that with beer. You've got a job to inhale it because the bubbles are popping. And you inhale it out of your nose. Oh. Definitely smells of apples, that goes without saying. But you do get that oaky sort of smell in there. See, I've never, when I, the last time I drank a cider, I hadn't done any beer reviews, so I, I, I didn't sort of have my routine of reviewing. But you do get that sort of nice oaky, sort of rich, sort of really juicy ripe apples. It smells like a really good cider. I'm going to dig in. Cheers everyone. Oh. oh. I think one of the reasons, another reason why I won't rate this is because I've tasted so many ciders and I do like most of them. This is absolutely beautiful. I mean, it, uh, they just all be 10 out of 10s. Um, this is, is, is a sweet. You get that sort of, it just tastes like alcoholic apple juice. It's massively refreshing. It does have a little bit too much carbonation to me, but I don't mind that in a cider. It's, it tastes real, it tastes crafted, it tastes beautiful. Um, here comes the Green Goblin from deep in the wood. A hundred year old oak vats that is. All right. Made with Somerset apples and matured in the oak. Green Goblin cider is a full flavoured, bittersweet blend, beautifully balanced to give a fresh character with a medium dry finish. All right, okay. One sip and your taste buds will be dancing with joy. Yeah, absolutely. www.thatcherscider.co.uk I miss that, actually. I used to buy these on a Sunday night. So, little story. I used to buy three or four bottles of cider and drink on Sunday night. And one Saturday, or one Sunday, I decided to buy two bottles of this and two bottles of Thatcher's Gold. And I woke up on Monday morning for work and I was absolutely bladdered still and I couldn't go to work because I was too drunk to drive into work. <laughs> so that's why I stopped drinking cider. Um, but I do enjoy it and now it's sort of, this has given me a bit of a bug to go back to cider now. But... Mm. I mean, I think that's a 10 out of 10 cider. I know I said I wouldn't rate it, but I love it. I think it's great. Brilliant. Thanks for watching everyone. Love to see your comments in the comments box. and. Um, Cheers.